Today I've got another Chubb Battleship. Got this one off eBay, only come yesterday. Unfortunately, didn't have any keys with it, which is a shame because this is one of the older ones. On the back, it's got 669. So this was made in June 1969. And on the front, if you can see that, it's actually got the Chubb Fish logo on the keyway cover with the words Chubb London. Then obviously on the front of the lock in big letters, Chubb London. So I actually think these are much better looking locks than these ones, even though they're the same body, that's just got Chubb on the front and no logo on the keyway cover. But this particular one was made in September 94. I've picked this one open a couple of times on camera. Obviously never picked this one because I've only just got it. Now when it came to me, it was open. So I've cleaned it up a little bit. I need to finish it off. And I've managed to clean the levers up inside and now it works okay. So to pick it open, you need to pick it closed. But to pick these closed, it's a lot easier than picking them open because you only need to lift one or two levers up. Goldilocks did a video showing you why you don't need to lift all the levers up. So let's just pick it closed. There you go. So that's now closed. And we'll have a go at picking it open in a minute, in a minute, I should say. Now this one is a nice old lock. You can see inside that one, look, when you actually close it, the bolt comes across and you can't see the levers. Lovely old lock. And I was hoping that the keys for this would work in this. So I put the keys in, got a bit of a turn and I thought, oh, it's gonna work, but it don't. So I need to make a key for this. Now Baldy Locks did a video a while ago and he made a key for one. So if you wanna make a key for one of these, watch Baldy Locks video. But if you do know any other videos out there where you can make a key for one of these, let me know because I'm gonna to attempt to make one. And I'd rather have a few videos to go off rather than just one. But the only one I could find was Baldy Locks and it's a cracking video. So yeah, let's see if we can pick this one open now. Yeah, it's a shame that key didn't fit. I would have been quids in because I didn't pay too much for this. When you buy locks without keys, you normally get them at the right price. They're not hard to pick anyway because there's no false gates in these. And if there is, I can't feel any. But Baldy Locks again on his video, he thought they weren't on in Chubb Cruisers and he stripped the Chubb Cruiser apart and he found out there was false gates in it. But I don't think there's any false gates in that one. So now we've got it back open again. So yeah, cool lock. I've got to try to make a key for it. Let me know if you know any other videos out there how to make a key. If you don't and you've got one yourself and you want to make a key, I recommend you go and visit Baldy Locks. Because like I say, he stripped a, a Chubb Cruiser apart, which is virtually the same mechanism inside. And he made a key for one of these. So that's it for today. As always, thanks for watching. And I'll see you again next time. Try a bit.